The Way of the Rain is uh, a collaboration and it's an homage to our planet Earth and its four universal elements. Having moved to the desert in New Mexico, I learned about the monsoon rains they have uh, seasonally during the summer months, which are extremely important because they provide water for the entire year in that region. I realized what an interesting idea it could be to uh, use the rain as a collaborator to create some abstract watercolors. So I reversed the wet to wet uh, technique um, and applying some uh, watercolor pigment on the dry paper, uh, waiting for the rains to come and carrying them outside where the raindrops then would uh, create the art on the paper. I felt that since I'm an environmental artist that I should uh, create a statement that would kind of create awareness and open up consciousness for people to look at something beautiful perhaps but with a message how endangered our earth is. I realized it would be a really great idea to incorporate some other art forms uh, with my art form to uh, kind of unite that and create a really strong statement to point towards the disaster and the distress that Earth is going through. I met Billy at Sundance when I was up there for a round table and we started talking about different art forms and I had heard that she had done this interdisciplinary art piece once before in New Mexico and started scratching my head and thinking that it sounded perfect for what we wanted to do here at Young Arts because with all the different disciplines that we work with here in visual literary performing arts with its dancers and its musicians and its theater and its film and its spoken word and this piece that she had done incorporated almost all of those different elements so I started thinking this would be a perfect way to start inaugurating the new program that we're doing on the campus. We're always trying to pick out new interesting art forms that we can bring in and have different masters work with our alums uh, and then give this experience to the community. The choreography and inspiration for Away the Rain came about from Sybil Ziggers Redford's silks, if you will. From listening to her and talking with her about the five elements, which are you know, the Big Bang Theory, the earth, water, fire, I really thought, wow, what can I add to this? And what, how can dance be a part of this? And then I looked at the gradation, actually, and thought there's so much variation in the silks and in the paint that perhaps what I could do is add the diversity of dance, which is add some contemporary ballet, a little bit of ballroom, hip-hop, all of those things combined to take the audience on a journey. It's so rewarding and inspiring to have these alums not only willing to come back, but actually even with the masters who work with us, you know, they come and they do it for free. They do it because they love to do it. This piece is a great example. We've been working with Robert Redford for years. They're inspired by working with these young artists and, you know, they get the inspiration themselves to continue their own art. I really wanted to be everybody giving an input, what their idea would be towards this concept and then really happen. I mean, this dream absolutely came true. You kind of inspire each other and the creation can become so much more powerful.